Hi, Brentech here, where tech is made simple. So just a quick video to show you how you can see and check how much memory your system can actually upgrade to on Windows 10 and Windows 11. Now, as an example, if you have noticed that your memory usage has been peaking out um, on your device, as an example, um, maybe your system is lagging or your system is freezing, you're getting plenty of blue screens of death, then that could be because um, your system is running out of memory and your usage is exceeding the amount of physical RAM, random access memory that's available for your device. Now, if you would like to check uh, to see how much RAM your system can actually take, because as an example, not every system can take an unlimited amount of actual physical memory, then it's actually quite simple to do. And for this, we're going to head over to PowerShell. And if you don't know where PowerShell is, um, you can just do a search for PowerShell um, from your search from the taskbar. But I've added mine to my right-click context menu for the start menu. And you must run it as administrator, else this will not work. And then what you need to do is enter this command into PowerShell. Now that's a mouthful, so I'll leave that down below so you can copy and paste that in for easy access and reference. So what you do in PowerShell, you enter that into... Uh, at the prompt, you enter that command, and then you hit enter, and there we go. So here we go. Um, I have two memory devices, and here's my maximum capacity I can upgrade to, 67108864. Now, what you need to take note of is that's not a true reflection. You've got to kind of round it off. So 67 means I can upgrade to a RAM capacity in gigabytes of 64 gigabytes. So just to break this down into further categories, if you've seen... 83, it means you can only upgrade to 8 gigabytes. If you've seen uh, 167, it means you can only upgrade to 16 gigabytes. If you've seen 335, as an example, you can only upgrade to 32 gigabytes. In my case, you can see I'm seeing 67.1. That means I can upgrade to 64. And if you see 134, you round it off. And that means you can upgrade to 128. So that's how much maximum capacity I can carry on this system if I want to do a RAM upgrade. Now, if you want to know how many slots you have, it's also quite simple. And for this, we head back to Task Manager. You head to your memory. And now you can see I'm using two of two slots. So uh, that means on this system, I've got eight gigabytes of RAM currently installed. So I'm using four in one slot and four in the other. So... Um, that just shows you how many slots you've got. So you can check for free slots on your computer. As an example, if you just want to add another chip of RAM to what you currently have. And I thought I'd just post that because I actually think this is quite useful, especially if you're wanting to do a RAM upgrade on your system. And that's just a quick way how you can check if you can upgrade your RAM on Windows 10 and Windows 11. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.